Well, I'm going to start this video off by showing you guys <laughs> the Mrs. K's 300. I'm going to get into what's happening in a moment. Let's go for a ride. Yeah. <laughs> This is uh, awkward. So I wanted to talk about something today and, you know, come out and uh, go for a ride, you know, quickly. Do a Monday video, no problem. Because I had something in my mind, because I had to discuss something with you guys. And I figured, you know what, you guys like motorcycles. You guys don't like the, the going off and doing the whole uh, car vlogs and all that stuff. So I decided to come out. Sure enough, it starts raining. <laughs> and actually, I think this is kind of uh, like a wet snow. Because that's what they're calling for. But that's supposed to be like in like four hours. So this came early. So regardless, I have my dark shades on, which is really, really bad. Um, and now the water is just like pelting me. That's not cool. So that's, that's yeah, that's not going to be fun. But I'm going to talk to you guys about Mrs. K's bike, regardless. Because we are doing something different. We are going to actually make some changes to Mrs. K's bike. And, you know, she decided to uh, hold on to her 300. And because of that, we said, okay, well, if you're going to hold on to your 300 anyway, let's get it redesigned. Let's let's make some changes, something that you're, uh, you're going to love, you know? So we went out bought a few things what are you doing dude slow down man it's raining <laughs> i have my light mode system on so he should be able to uh you know see me um so yeah we went out and we said okay let's let's do some changes to the bike and go from there you know take your time no problem ah you son of a see people just walk across the whole freaking thing like as if it was nothing I could have gone if it wasn't slippery, but considering it's just started raining, I am not risking it. I'm not that crazy. So you guys saw it with regards to the 650, what's been going on with it. Um, this bike is just an unbelievable bike and I, you know, for me, Mrs. K deciding not to upgrade her bike, it makes sense. It's her bike, it's her choice and she, you know, whatever she feels comfortable with. And that's what I told her, just do whatever you feel comfortable with. You feel comfortable upgrading, then upgrade. If not, don't do it, you know, don't uh, don't upgrade just for the sake of upgrading. So she decided to stick with the 300 for another season at least. And then that's why I said, you know, if, if, if you're gonna hold on to it anyway, go for it. You know, go for uh, designing the bike the way you want it designed, have it look the way you want it to look because ultimately it's your bike you have to be you know you have to be the one that feels very comfortable with it and you're the one that has to show it off and take pictures and yeah blah 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 you know all that fun stuff so when uh, she decided on you know, obviously getting rid of the wrap that we put on there previously and um yeah we're, so we're gonna you know put a new wrap on her so that bike is gonna be pretty interesting now because as i see the new wrap you guys don't see it you guys don't know what it is, but I do. <laughs> and I'm not going to tell you. Why? Because she will kill me. So, yeah, basically that's what, you know, that's going to be the biggest thing, the wrap itself. I know that she's thinking about possibly doing graphics. Maybe, maybe not. I'm not saying anything because it's a secret. And she doesn't want me to tell that secret. In fact, she didn't even really want me to talk much about, you know, um, the bike in general. But as you guys saw in the beginning of the video... Uh, the bike is kind of in pieces right now, and it's gonna be like that for a little bit So that's probably why you guys are not gonna see her riding although more than likely it's because of the weather But even if the weather gets better, she's not gonna ride. She could always take out my 300 I guess So yeah, I know she's waiting on a few things um, I Don't know if everything will arrive here like you know more or less around the same time or are they all gonna come at different times? I don't know. I know we have for sure the wrap. And I'll tell you guys, on Ninja 300, taking off the body and taking off all the pieces that are there, and it's such a pain. It's not, it's not, I, I'm not gonna say it's time consuming, because you can, you know, you can take off both sides in under an hour. 
um, even sooner if you know what you're doing. I've never taken a body off before. She was so cute uh, because she actually tried taking off the body and all that fun stuff. So <laughs> I actually, I have some clips of that. Everybody, it's me, Mrs. K. How's it going? I am going to be doing something interesting today. I am going to try to take off my fairings for the first time ever by myself because, well, it makes it easier to do the design that I want to do. So I'm going to get started. See the fairings right there. I'm going to take those off and I brought a piece of paper and pen so that I can mark everything down so I know exactly which bolts will go where. Well, I've taken apart that one, this, I got some down here. Now I have to figure out how to unclip that. That one right here. We're gonna go around to the other side and see if we can take this piece off because this little part here, I can't seem to get myself. So I wanna see if I can just pull this whole piece down. So I'm gonna try taking that apart and see what happens. So I already gave in and I asked Mr. K to come down to give me some assistance because so far, so far, this is all I've gotten. I have gotten this part loose here and I can't seem to do the same on the other side. So, yeah, I feel like I failed, <laughs> but we'll see. Maybe I can still salvage it. Right there. Mr. K has come and saved the day. Of He's course. taking everything off like it's nothing. Like he already knew exactly what he was doing. Yeah, I learned. So yeah, she tried to do all that fun stuff and then she eventually called me. She goes, Mrs. Mr. K, I need your help. So I said, okay, I'm gonna come and help you. So yeah, there's a lot of stuff. Like I took off parts of the Ninja 650 and mostly because I wanted to do a few things and it, I don't know the parts of the, the body of the 650 definitely came off a lot faster <laughs> than the Ninja 300 I just I don't know if that's just the way it's connected or what it was but either way that's the big update that's that's what you guys get for this Monday I really wanted to stay out today and do a little bit of a, a Wednesday vlog for you guys but this week, I don't think we're going to have a Wednesday vlog, but I do have an idea actually. Maybe we will. There's still a possibility you guys can get a vlog on Wednesday, but it's not going to be a motorcycle vlog. More than likely, it's going to be a life vlog, and I don't know. It should be fun, but if there is a lot of drops on my camera, I apologize right now, and I'm sorry. If you're still here, I want to say thank you for putting up with that. And uh, aside from that, I'm going to say love, right, explore. Oh, hey, guys, I almost forgot to tell you. So, uh, you guys have been asking where you guys can get the new stickers. Can I do something? Because you guys want the new stickers. You guys want the love, right, explore stickers. You guys want the cow couple stickers, blah, 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 blah. Okay, so if you guys go to the website, on our website now, we're going to have, well, we do have, I should say, uh, the stickers. I put up the stickers for sale. Can you believe it? I listened to you guys. You wanted stickers. I gave you stickers. Because, you know, I'm Mr. K and I rock. That's that's just what I'm going to go with because, you know. So, yeah. Stop, dude. Stop. Oh, my goodness. The rain's coming down. And like a dodo bird, I have my dark visor, which means I cannot close it because I won't be able to see anything. So now... Oh goodness, this is harsh. Well, if nothing else, you guys are probably getting a really good laugh out of this right now. Ah! Is it? Oh man. Oh, I want to go home. I want to go home. I want to go home. Ah! That hurts. And the second I put down my dark visor, I know what's going to happen. There's going to be a cop that's going to pull up and he's going to pull me over for having a dark visor. That's what's going to happen. So I am nowhere near going to be crazy enough to put the dark visor. Plus, I won't see anything. Woo. Oh, oh, boy, oh, boy. Guys, I'm going to leave it here because I got to get my behind home ASAP. So, uh, before I get my eyes poked out by rain, thank you very much for watching. As always, you know, we love you. I hope you guys enjoyed this video of me getting punished by the rain. Till next time, goodbye and uh, see ya. Yeah, see ya. I'm going to take this trip nice and slow because... Okay.
Hey, see, I'm all good now. Okay, bye. See ya. See ya. Go, lady, go. You're doing freaking 25. Holy smokes, dude. 25. Not even half the speed, well, half the speed limit, exactly. Okay, seriously, this time I'm gonna say, we love ya, goodbye, see ya later, ouch, bye.